Battlefield 2016 is a hot topic right now. Battlefield 4 is still going strong, keeping people playing with more free content than ever and seeing player numbers increasing. Roughly 120 to 140,000 people playing every day. And that's an amazing stat for a game that is nearly two years old and in a time where people want content all the time and will move on very quickly. But it does seem that even the smallest amount of information on the next game is getting people excited. We already know the game is set to be based back in the traditional military setting, so no Hardline 2 here, but we've got no information about a time setting for this game. Could it be modern day like Battlefield 4? Could it be historical like the older titles of 1942? Or could it be futuristic, maybe seeing a sequel to Battlefield 2142? At this point, we still don't know. But what we do know is that development is starting to ramp up. Last week, Dan Vaderlind, development director at DICE, gave us the firmest indication yet that the game is being heavily worked on. Now that we've shipped Battlefront and a part of the team continues to work on it, I am moving on to another project, the next Battlefield. Something else that we can be confident on is which development team are going to be making the game. There have now been three development studios with hands in the Battlefield pie. DICE, based in Stockholm, Sweden, the original team still containing many veteran workers who know Battlefield before we even knew what it was. DICE LA, an offshoot of the Stockholm office containing lots of experienced developers and many from the previously closed Danger Close team who worked on Medal of Honor Warfighter. And finally, Visceral Games, a newcomer to the series with Hardline, which largely failed to capture the interest of the more military-minded gamers out there. Based on Dan's tweet and with his colleague Johan Lundmark, we can be pretty confident that the studio producing this game is the main team in Stockholm. Johan posted this. Off Star Wars Battlefront and on to Battlefield. I guess I gotta get that Star Wars fix elsewhere. I think this conclusion makes sense and also gives more of an idea on what to expect from the game itself as we still have no idea what it's going to be. DICE Stockholm is where Battlefield began, and as much as their last few entries to the series haven't been what veterans of the series necessarily wanted, they have still managed to gather huge numbers of players. These games have been extremely successful, with Bad Company 2 now holding a cult following, Battlefield 3 remaining overall the most popular title ever in the franchise, as well as being top for player satisfaction, and Battlefield 4 showcasing how product support like free DLC way after the release can hold on to players for years after the end of the game's standard DLC cycle. Based on those facts, I think we're going to see another game that epitomizes what Battlefield is all about. Big, open military warfare encompassing all aspects of battle. But I'm not sure where to put my money on when it comes to the setting. I'd love to see another modern day Battlefield title building on the vast improvements to the Frostbite engine that DICE LA did with Battlefield 4, but then I'd also love to see a return to the World War II style warfare, or perhaps not as far back, and maybe a fictional Cold War era conflict. One thing is certain though, I'll not be best pleased if the game is futuristic. Too many shooters have gone that way in the recent past and Battlefield going there is not going to be good for Game of Variety. I wouldn't rule it out though, who knows where we'll be going. So there, Battlefield 2016 really is into full production now, and it's likely not long till we learn more about what's coming next. Battlefield 4 was revealed in March time and Hardline ended up getting leaked in May, June. So I'd expect an announcement between those months of the year and considering the game is likely to fall into the September, October release window, that fits just about perfectly. Let me know what you think of Battlefield 2016. What do you want it to be? Let me know down in the comments and while you're there, drop me a like as well. But until next time, my name is Westy and I'll catch you guys in the next video.